Welcome to School 2020. In this video, we will discuss about kidney, its structure, function and importance in human body. What is kidney? The kidneys are two reddish brown bean sheet organs found in vertebrates. They are located on the left and right in the retroperitoneal space and in adult humans are about 12 cm in length. They receive blood from the paired renal arteries. Blood exists into the paired renal veins. Each kidney is attached to a ureter, a tube that carries excreted urine to the bladder. Structure of kidney diagram of kidney. Now we will go through the theory of structure of kidney. Position. Two kidneys lie at the back of the abdominal cavity at about waist level where they are protected to some extent by the spine and the lower part of the ribcage. Usually the left kidney is slightly above the right. At the anterior end of each kidney is present an adrenal gland. Size and shape. Each kidney is a bean shaped structure. They are somewhat reddish brown or brown in color. The outer side is concave and the inner side is convex. In adult male they are 11 cm long, 6 cm wide and 3 cm thick. It weighs about 125 to 170 gram in male and 115 to 155 gram in female. Parts So there are 10 parts in kidney. Number 1 nephron, number 2 helum, number 3 Ureter, number 4, renal vein, number 5, renal artery. No, there is basically 9 parts. I mistakenly typed ureter twice. So, number 7, renal pelvis, number 8, renal capsule, number 9, renal pyramid, number 10, uriniferous tubule. Now we will go through the description of the parts. On the concave side of the kidney is a median indentation called hilum through which the ureter and renal vein comes out of the kidney and the renal artery enters the kidney. Two ureters arise from each kidney proceeding downwards to open, the, open into the urinary bladder. The funnel shape extended part of the ureter is called the renal pelvis. Each kidney is surrounded by a peritoneal membrane called tunica fibrosa which is made of connective tissue. Kidneys are closed with a special fibrous membrane called the renal capsule. Adjacent to the renal capsule is the cortex and the inner side is the medulla. There are 8 to 12 renal pyramids in the medulla. The apex of each pyramid is called papilla. These papilla project directly into the ureter. Each kidney contains a particular type of tubules called uriniferous tubules. Each uriniferous tubule has two parts, the nephron which produces urine and the collecting tubules which carry urine to the pelvis. Functions of kidney The kidneys are essential for homeostasis, maintaining a constant internal environment of the body's extracellular fluids. Their basic functions include number one, regulation of extracellular fluid volume, 
The kidneys work to ensure an adequate quantity of plasma to keep blood flowing to vital organs. Number two, regulation of osmolarity. The kidneys help to keep extracellular fluid from becoming too dilute or concentrated with respect to the solutes carried in the fluid. Number three, regulation of iron concentration. The kidneys are responsible for maintaining relatively constant levels of key ions including sodium, potassium and calcium. Number four, regulation of pH. The kidneys prevent blood plasma from becoming too acidic or basic by regulating ions. Number 5. Excretion of wastes and toxins. The kidneys filter out a variety of water-soluble waste products and environmental toxins into the urine for excretion. Number 6. Production of hormones. The kidneys produce erythropoietin which stimulates red blood cell synthesis and renin, which helps control salt and water balance and blood pressure. They, also, they are also involved in regulating plasma calcium and glucose levels. Importance of kidney The major function of the kidneys is to remove waste products and excess fluid from the body. These waste products and excess fluid are removed through the urine. The production of urine involves highly complex steps to excretion and reabsorption. This process is necessary to maintain a stable balance of body chemicals. The critical regulation of the body's salt, potassium and acid content is performed by the kidneys. The kidneys also produce hormones that affect the function of other organs. For example, a hormone produced by the kidneys stimulates red blood cell production. Other hormones produced by the kidneys help regulate blood pressure and control calcium metabolism. That is why the significance of kidneys is human body in a human body is immense. If you like our videos, please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe our channel.